Hello Geminis. This is your mid-month reading. This is a general. Let's see. Uh-oh. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. I'm not ready yet, guys. <laughs> if you're new, welcome to the channel. Please like, share, and subscribe. Personal reading information is down below the video, guys. Let's see what we've got going on for my Geminis. What do Geminis need to know for the 15th through the 31st of January, Gemini? Celtic Cross. Here we go. Energy surrounding you. Was crossing you or challenging you. Why you're here. What's the foundation of all of this, okay? The recent past. The best possible outcome. The near future. How you see yourself. Hmm outside influence, your hopes, your fears, and the overall outcome. All right. So <clears throat> the energy surrounding you is a higher fan, um, feeling like, you know, your morals, your ethics, they're right. They're right for you. You feel like they're right for um, everybody. I think you do. You try to do what's best for everybody involved. But this is like a strong um, sense of self here. You're confident in the things that that you believe in, the things that you do. Okay, very confident in that. Hmm. Your challenge is the Ten of Pentacles. I think this is. You know, you getting what it is that you want. Um, maybe somebody that is humble. Maybe somebody that, um, you know, has meets you on a, not just a financial level, but as far as the things that you believe. Um, that's what your challenge is here. Okay. Sure, we'll come back to that. Let's see why you are here. Okay, I think you're here because of the Queen of Wands. Could be somebody that you know, a fire sign for sure. You could have fire in your chart, but this could actually be somebody as well um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius um, that you are thinking about possibly having a relationship with somebody that you can actually, you know, grow older with, you know somebody you possibly want to marry even and have this ten of pentacles you know a solid stable relationship committed relationship here let's see how you view yourself you view yourself as very communicative you view yourself as like I mean you like to travel you like to move you don't like things that are ordinary you don't like things that are slow okay so you want somebody that vibes on the same level as you I feel Okay. Very Sagittarius energy. Okay, let's see where you're coming from here in the past. Hmm. I feel like you guys were working on something together. Definitely. Definitely working on something together, trying to build something, probably trying to build up this relationship because we do see the Ten of Pentacles here. Um, so I, I get the feeling that this is this is you being challenged to finish what you started here with this Eight of Pentacles. This is what I'm getting. To finish what you started here with this Eight of Pentacles, building on this connection and getting it to a point where you guys finish this, like you lock this in. Possibly with this fire sign energy here, okay? Now, the best possible outcome? Well, as you see, the Six of Cups is here. Happiness. You guys reuniting. You guys blending your families. This is somebody you've spent a lot of time with here. Um, maybe you guys even have, if you're older, you know, you have grandkids together, kids together. Um, this is somebody you've known a long time here. Okay. But happiness for sure. Let's see in the near future, we have the Ace of Earth. Yeah. 
a brand new start. A lot of pentacles here. Brand new start. Now, for some of you, yes, this is regarding um, like your income, your money, starting a new business, building upon that, getting to a point where you know you are like financially secure, having a windfall here after you've started something very lucrative for you, feeling very inspired, knowing what you have to do here, and then feeling very inspired, you know to do so maybe it involves a lot of communication with people even okay so you know it could go either way for your job or whether this is a relationship for for you okay but i sense that this is a relationship for a lot of people because you know i primarily do love but definitely could be a job definitely okay so but this is a new start this is a new offer very stable <gasps> excuse me my gosh stable offer that could bring a lot of abundance your way okay and i do feel like you know for the relationship aspect of this okay so you're being challenged to finish what you started here with the eight of pentacles okay so if this is something that you're needing to finish, I feel like this is somebody that you're probably separate from. Um, and because the tens are completions, but guess what? We start over again. So maybe, you know, you guys ended a cycle with someone and here you are starting over again with the ace of earth, with the ace of pentacles. Brand new start, brand new offer, brand new um, start of a relationship, okay? So, in your outside influence, we have the Three of Cups. Somebody wanting to reunite. Somebody feeling like you are where, you know, their happiness is complete. You are where their happiness is complete. They feel very abundant with you. They feel very full. They feel like, you know, you guys, you love each other. And that you should be together is what I'm getting with this. Very strong there. Hmm. This is the Three of Cups. I don't know if I said that. What your hopes are. This is the Four of Wands. If this is not marriage... This is you being in a strong um, relationship or, you know, just feeling very strong within yourself that, you know, everything is good with you. Everything is good with you, that things are how they should be. You're hoping that everything falls into place the way it should be. And if it's marriage, then it's marriage. If it's a relationship, it's relationship, okay? If it is um, a job, it, it's that. So whatever, whatever things falling into place means for you, that's what this is. The Four of Wands, perfection. Everything is as it should be, okay? Your fear is the Two of Cups. Your fear is finding somebody that, um, you know... You want somebody to be in love with you. You don't want to be with somebody and you love them way more than they love you. You want somebody that vibes with you. That everything is everything between the two of you and you share in this. You don't want things to be one-sided. You want both of you to be all in here. Okay? And in the overall outcome, we have the Ace of Air. Somebody is speaking some truth here. Whether it's you or the other person, my Geminis, somebody is coming forward to say, hey, um, we belong together. Hey, let's sit down and talk. Let's talk about this. Because what we have is very strong. What we have is very abundant. What we have is solid, stable, love we have this mutual 
love for each other. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah. All this is like building up around this hierophant. With the pentacles here. All the elements are here. So just take the situation as it resonates. And um, I will be speaking with you guys soon. Bye now.